All right, y'all. So I'm just gonna get everything started while I wait for everybody to show up. Of course, when we do these franchises, I've got to use the preseason just because it's all that makes sense. Okay, so just waiting for people to show up so people can witness the new series that I am bringing to the channel. So hopefully... Dustin, the gaming dad, now. Okay, so let's get let's get this started soon. I'm just gonna sit here and wait for people before. Just letting people know. Actually, what I want to do, I'm going to go in the creation center. I'm going to start to create a player. I'm just going to do the bears real quick just so we know. Just so it's on the first team on the list. That way I can just... Oh, you can't just scroll through, my bad. Okay, so... trying to find just trying to wait for people to show up you know just doing some ok 
Okay, so I'm just gonna go through here. Welcome to franchise mode. Just waiting around, trying to wait for people to show up. Okay, so just trying to wait this out, you know, just thinking, trying to find, you know. Okay, so I'm just gonna do this, so... Um... I'm going to think I'm going to do
Okay, just trying to... I'm just gonna keep going because I mean people aren't I've been on for I've been waiting for 10 minutes almost 11 minutes so I'm just gonna let things happen how they're gonna happen 96 is the only number that we can find I'm not gonna go to Clemson Dayton is near and dear to my heart Hmm? Yeah. If you want to get people to watch, now's the time because right now nobody's watching. Because it took so long. So you only got like two? Most likely. Most likely. So, oh yeah, I'm not watching TV. Hmm? No. Well, Dad said you're not allowed to sleep in here, anyways. I don't know. I'm sorry, what Dad said. What's up, Brad? So I wanted to bring back the Malik series, but I realized somehow it got deleted. All right. So I'll just let you in on what's going on afterwards. Okay, so we're just doing, the name doesn't really matter right now, we can pick a new name later on. Like whenever, whenever we go through, if you don't, if we don't, if we end up not liking the name, we can always just get another one. We'll keep Michigan State, because they, they produce beasts, so we're good. No, I don't want to exit out.
You already know that this dude is going to be looking like a monster. Even if he doesn't play like a monster at first, he's going to look like one. Okay, so... Ooh, they already gave him a visor. I did not even... I did not even program that. Like, I have not even moved, but they gave it to him. He's got that linebacker visor. I love those. That's the one I use. Personally, it's my favorite. You know the linebackers making the big hits. They gotta have those... They gotta have the huge, they gotta have the sleeve, the back plates to make sure they don't hurt themselves. He's gonna have the left sleeve. And then his right elbow is gonna be a elbow brace. That's sexy. Just gonna do a little bit of tape, you know what I mean? Let's go. I actually have never done a defensive player on these. On a career, never done it before. These lunar beasts are sexy. I actually don't want to be using these. I'd rather use the Nike Knits. I think they have these now. Yeah, the Nike the Nike Vapors. Let's go. That's nice. Hey, Brad, let me know whenever you can hear me. Ooh, okay. We're going to have some fun with this dude. 72 overall, which means we'll have a decent starting spot for the preseason. We're going to go into the... Yeah, so we're starting in the preseason. Going to league settings, so like y'all can see, we're on all Madden. Instant starters off. Trade deadlines on. All this stuff is on. I don't care. Everyone can relocate. It's not going to hurt us. Trade existing is off. Practice squad stealing. Not going to matter for us. I'm going to go eight minutes. Actually, we're going to go nine because the, the, the careers are going to work a lot faster. All this stuff's going to go go on because it's not going to matter for me. So, we are starting the career. If y'all don't like his number, y'all don't like his name, that's basic stuff I can change when I go in. You can change his name, you can change his number. It's easy. Okay, so... I let Dustin know that I was that I was streaming, but I don't know if he got the message. He's a busy man, I'm assuming. Probably, probably got caught up in something else. But I need to figure out what I can spend 700 XP on to 
build up because right now I think we only need to get to like a 73. Because we're the second stringer right now. We're back up. We're playing second fiddle to James Laurinaitis right now. So right now like 700 XP would boost our finesse move up. It would give us a, some work on our pursuit which would help us. A lot of these key stats like the finesse, power move, pursuit, block shedding, hit power tackle. Everything in between play wreck and toughness are your key are your key attributes. Those are the ones that you want to work on. So tackle, hit power, block shedding, pursuit, power moves, finesse moves, man coverage, zone coverage. These are all of the stats that you actually need to care about. Everything else throughout out the window it doesn't really matter. I mean, play wreck and awareness are obviously important. But I mean, if you're using the character, the play recognition is going to be yours and not the character if you can't recognize the if you don't recognize the play it doesn't matter that the dude has a 99 play rec same thing for awareness if you're if you're football if you're football stupid it doesn't matter if you have a, a 99 awareness because you're not going to get the play right i mean i've got some i've got an 88 speed that's really good for a linebacker especially 6'4 245 got a decent strength decent acceleration really high agility so i mean that's really good. So I think I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna sim through the, just gonna simulate the practice, and then do the, I can do play rack on one. Actually, I can do play rack twice. Doesn't boost my overall, but it helps me a lot. So what are my goals right now? Right now, 20 tackles. Three tackles will give me 75. So three tackles will give me two. Okay, so right now I'm just, right now my goal is three tackles, which I mean playing in the preseason at middle linebacker, I'll be starting. So it's not gonna be that difficult. Wow. So we're starting the first game. So Ryan Palmer, the start of a career. And I want to, I wanted to start the Malik Anderson series back up, but some somebody deleted the file. So I'm gonna do something else with with Malik Anderson, and y'all will figure it out. Y'all will y'all will hear what it is later, whenever I whenever. Whenever I explain it, you'll 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 love the idea. Once <clears throat> do I get? Ooh, look! I'm on the tackle. I'm on the I'm on the tackle squad. I'm on the hands team, y'all. Oh, I missed the tackle. So we got a huge game for us. Obviously, we're just going to sim fast until we play. 
goal line defense. It's not going to give us the chance. Oh, it is. Hey, look, we're in goal line defense. Oh, I've got man on Gronk, my first play. This is bull. <laughs> hey, look, it worked. Except for I completely broke my man coverage. I'm not even in this play, so it's not my fault. I didn't want to blitz again because they're... It would have been perfect time to blitz, but it's whatever. This preseason's gonna move a lot quicker whenever we start to get reps. Okay, just wait for... I'm on every single special team right now, y'all. Every single special team. Every single special team. Please let me play soon. Now I remember why I hated the preseason in the Malik Anderson series. Because it is so boring when you're not playing. Ah, oh, come on. I should have I should have done backspin, but I'm more I'm more concerned about the linebacker that we're playing as. I'm more concerned about Ryan Palmer. Uh, let's do Thunder Smoke. I just wanted to call a play that I was in. I got caught up right in a block. I'm the starter now, so we're, it's in the second quarter now. So we don't have to worry about it. Oh, it's a, this is a pass play. It's definitely a pass. It's got to be. There's no quarterback. There's no running back. So now we can call any play that we want to and not have to worry about it. We're going to keep covering, calling cover two, though. No, this is cover three. My bad. Cover three. Ooh, this is going to be a blitz. I mean, this, I need to blitz this. Oh, that was my that was my job. I thought he was running it, so I jump I jumped way down. I I picked I picked middle linebacker because it's gonna help me work on my user skills. Like that is the that is the reason I picked middle linebacker because it is going to help me fix my awful user skills. Like, if I can get some picks in, picks in this career, then it'll help me with my instincts. Got no, I got no block shedding. I have no block shedding ability whatsoever. Man, this is unfair. Playing the Patriots two nights in a row. Just realized that. Ooh, let's go hit stick. I knew they were going to him. That's our first tackle, y'all. First career tackle. But I'm not going to count it because it's only preseason. It doesn't really count. I mean, it counts as a tackle, but not really to me. Ooh. Pick, let's go. Pick six. Let's go. Who is that? Oh, I couldn't. Even, I can't replay it. Oh, it was Damian Swan. Good job, man. So we're up. I mean, we, we we're not up actually. Never mind, I'm lying. We're not up, but we're 
We're working on it. Let's go. Let's go. This is going to be a fun series to work on. I feel like I love defense. I'm going to bring back the Malik Anderson series, but I'm going to do it in a different fashion than most people are going to expect. I was there with him. I'm glad that he hit him because I wasn't going to be able to catch up. I don't like that sleeve because I'm a white dude. And so it's like the sleeve just looks like they didn't render my arm well enough. Fourth down, let's go. Can we score, please? No. Oh, he threw it out. Okay. Right now my stat sheet includes one tackle. That O-line is just punishing us right now, y'all. Man, I'm getting thrown around, y'all. No block shedding. I have no... I have no authority right now. They're just running it because they want to. That's a block in the back, actually, but they aren't going to call it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to blitz right now. I'm going to bait him. Let's go. That's my second tackle. Yeah, I think we're going to change the color of his sleeve because it just looks like his arm isn't rendered well enough. If he was a... Oh, come on. You had one job. Hey, thanks. Good job, man. You had one job, and you injured Martellus Bennett. Good job, man. I mean, you gave up a first down, so, I mean, if you could have injured Clay Harbor. Clay Harbor's actually still a beast. I mean, their third string tight end could start on most of my team. It would start on some teams. Jimmy G. I love Jimmy Garoppolo. Like, he's that quarterback that makes me upset because he's a starting quality quarterback, but he. What is my man coverage? My man is Deion Lewis. This is, this is my player career. 
This is Ryan Palmer. I was gonna keep going with my Malik Anderson series, but it got <laughs> it got um the file got corrupted. Uh Hey Brad, whenever you can whenever you're able to talk, let me know, man. It doesn't even matter how if we win or lose the game right now because preseason, all I'm worried about is just my stats. I'm just worried about getting tackles and getting some. I need like I think I need one more tackle. I don't think I think I only have two right now, and I know that three gives me the 75 gives me uh, will give me like 150 XP. That's my tackle. That's my tackle. That is my tackle. Come on, y'all. I had my zone locked down. It's like every single time I do the right job, they mess up. With careers, you can't help. With the career, you can't help it if you win or lose a game. You know what I mean? Unless you play a, like a, a really, really, really influential position. Something like um, if you play quarterback or what or running back. Really, any offensive position is super influential on the game. But if it's not one of those like big four positions, quarterback, receiver, running back, or tight end, you really have no influence on the game. I mean, like, yeah, the linebacker can make like a key tackle or the corner can make a key pick. But unless you score on that play, you're not making a huge impact. And that's why I picked this because all it's about is my career. I don't have to worry about winning or losing the game. I mean, I do have to worry about winning or losing, but I'm saying my job is just to hit people. And that's awesome. All I have to do is make tackles. You know what I mean? That's a major screen. I should have I should have bet on that eat quicker. I knew he was doing it, I just didn't for some reason, I just decided not to jump it at the time. Okay, so let's get... Let's keep doing some zone coverage. Ooh, he missed that. I hate it because it's like either they throw it right into my zone when I'm not in my zone or I'll be in my zone the whole time and they throw it and they don't even pay attention to me. 
Let's go. There we go. Then we got a tackle. Goal completed. Three tackles. There's our weekly goal. Something we need to work on is our block shedding. Our block shed is awful. Same for our finesse move. We can, those little tiny stats like that, that's gonna be what's gonna get our stats up. Oh, I, I blitzed straight through there and I still missed him. It's like we, I literally just missed him. Okay, so. Let's go, let's go. I can't believe Dion Lewis is the backup. I mean, I'm pretty sure like Joke Bell is the starter or something, but. There we go, we got a tackle. I get like three XP every time I make a tackle. And I'm pretty sure you got more for doing tackle for loss. I mean, I haven't had any of those because I'm not, I'm not able to get to the backfield. And when I am, it's not. Let's go. That's some of the best pass blocking I've ever had. I've had right now. Man, if we could, if we could score, that'd be great. It's like I have no, we can't score at all, but. I can't expect to be like an amazing linebacker though. I mean, I'm only a 72 overall. And the 72 overall, I'm probably as a 72 overall, I'm probably looking at. I'm probably playing against guys that are like 75, 76 at line. So that's why I'm struggling so hard to get them off because I can't. I'm not. Oh, my overall is not high enough. There we go, I was in on that. Yes, we are losing this, but I mean, I'm having a decent game. I've got like three and a half tackles. I can't even tell if those tackles are... Okay, so I've got four tackles currently on my stat sheet. So, I mean, that's, a, that's an achievement. Every tackle is going to give me stats. Every play will give me... Stats as long as I don't do the wrong thing and play something stupid like that. If it's a run, I'm just supposed to hit my gap. Like, like you're trying to do the most. So I'm just not. I'm not even hitting my gaps right. Let's go! I popped him. 
It's not gonna matter though, cause I mean he picked up the first, but I still stuck him. I mean we're losing big, so I don't even. It's not even. It's not gonna affect us, so I'm just gonna blitz. Let's go, tactical loss. That gives me eight XP. That's my second tack for loss. I put myself in position there. That's that's why I wanted to pick. That's why I wanted to play middle linebacker. Those hits, those game, those plays where I where I get behind the line and just and stop them. That feels awesome. Well, I mean, it would still be nice to end this game with an interception if I could. But I mean, I'm playing against Jimmy Garoppolo, so probably not. This is like Madden's love child. Do y'all remember on um, the Road to Glories on NCAA 13 or 14? I can't remember which one. On the Road to Glories, you could, you could slow down time. You could do like the... <gasps> oh, I missed the hit stick. I'm garbage. <laughs> Missed my hit stick. I honestly should have baited that, tried to pick it, but I didn't want to. If I would have jumped that quicker, I could have like jumped. I, I could have jumped up and tried to get in the way of it, but I didn't. It's okay, though. We've got like, we have like six tackles. It's not, the game's not even a game. It's not, it's not, it doesn't matter. Preseason doesn't matter anyways. All I'm trying to do is just get, get the starting spot. I might not try, I might not upgrade my player. I might keep. I might keep this, play second string the whole time, the whole preseason, and then during preseason week four, just take and use the rest of the XP, because you get more playing time and as a backup. Hmm. Let me know. That's a smart idea. I feel like I feel like that's a good idea. Oh. Okay, so we got Hey Perry, let me know whenever you're off Skype, okay? Okay, what is going on? Okay, so I went to restart the Malik Anderson series tonight, and then sad day, my the file for the Malik Anderson series was corrupted. I wanted to start. I wanted to start off where I left. Start where I left off, and so I went to start the Malik Anderson series, and it wasn't there. And so it occurred to me that the that if me and Dustin go through with doing some sort of franchise, some sort of player career, whatever we decide to do, I could use Malik Anderson since he's already since I already have his stats on my phone, I already know what he is. I already know who he is. Anybody who's watched the channel knows who he is. He's our it would it would just it makes more sense. So this dude is Ryan Palmer. He is 
a middle linebacker from Michigan State because he's a fan favorite, because that's a fan favorite on the channel. And, I mean, he had the second most tackles on the team. So, I mean, that's good. He had 11 tackles. But I picked I picked him just because it's it's going to give us a player career until me and Dustin get sorted out whatever we're going to do. So that is what's going on currently. If you don't like the name, you can tell me what to change it to. I'm already going to change his... I'm already going to change his, one of his outfit things because it's. I realize that white guys don't look good in gold sleeves. It just looks like his arm isn't rendered all the way and it looks ugly. It looks like someone dipped his arm in honey mustard. And that's not pretty at all. But here are our stats right now. 88 speed, 88 excel, 89 agility, 85 strength, 90 jumping. Yeah, 11 tackles is really solid. Didn't get didn't get a pick, didn't get a uh, pass deflection. We got 6 to 1 carrying. None of this stuff really matters. 62 catching. Um 70 play rec, 75 tackle, 88 hit power, 72 block shed, 74 pursuit. This needs to rise, the 65 finesse, but we got 72 power move, 70 man coverage, 78 zone, and 65 press. And then those stats, you always got a 99, you always got a 99 toughness and a 99 injury as a creative player, I feel like. So I'm going to go to his sleeve and I'm going to do a primary sleeve because it's just because the black is too much black and the gold is just ugly. So I'm just going to do a white sleeve. It works. But if you didn't hear me say it earlier, I am not going to spend any XP until after the week four game of the preseason. Because the longer I'm the backup, the more playing time I get in the preseason. And the more playing time I get in the preseason, the more, um, the more XP I can get. So like right now I've got 947 XP. If last game I got 240, and I if I got, if I got like 200 something, I got 700 now. So I had 247 XP. If I keep going at that rate, I could have easily 3,000 XP by the time we get to the preseason. But get through preseason, and let me just show you what I could spend 3,000 XP on. I could move my tackle up. My block shedding, power move, finesse move, man coverage. You know what I mean? Just so I mean, I feel like in my head that works. If you've got a better idea, let me know. If you feel like you would rather just see me become the starter right away. Because I mean, I'm pretty sure right now I could probably become the starter at week two. It would make the episode a lot quicker, but I mean, I don't got anywhere to go except for sleep, but not even that tired. Just spent like an hour trying to fix my PlayStation. Finally got it to work. Yeah, I messaged Dustin, but... I feel like dude probably fell asleep. Don't blame him. It's like 1.30 in the morning where I'm at. And I'm I don't know where Dustin lives. I'm assuming he lives in the U.S. But I mean, if he lives in 
if he lives in another country, let me know, because I really, I, I, all I know about him is his name's Dustin, and he's a gaming dad. And he's got some adorable kids, and the only reason I know that's because he's because he's got them on his profile pic. I hope that's not weird to say. Okay, he lives in Cali. So, I mean, yeah, it's like 11 o'clock there, probably. Something around there. I don't know what time it is in Cali. I'll look it up right now. I'm not going to lie. I do this all the time for Australia. Like, I have it bookmarked on my phone. What time is it in Australia? Specifically Sydney. Not going to lie. Because I'm not trying to wake you up, wake you up saying something stupid. Yeah, right now it's 11:30 p.m. So I mean, he, he's probably out. I catch myself doing it sometimes. Like sometimes I'll go to send you like a meme or a vine or something, and then I'm like, dude, what am I doing? It's not even like five in the morning there right now. Like it's four. It's like 4:30 in Australia. What am I doing? <laughs> That's the problem with having a friend in another country. Oh, I'm stupid. I just realized why my last, why the last drive felt weird. Why the, why that first play? Cause I was, I was like going on the wrong side. Dude, I'm legit just gonna take off. Not even gonna work on blocking. Just gonna take off. I wasn't gonna try and get like directionally messed up. I'm just trying to wait until we can get to the second quarter. That, this is the hardest part of doing. Part of me wants to do the fake punt pass just because I'd be involved with it. I wouldn't be running a route, but that'd be, that's the reason why I did it because I didn't, wouldn't be running a route. If I was running a route on it, I definitely would have done it. It, that kills me every time. Hey, we're winning this game though, so I mean that's good. Figured I'm gonna play the preseason of this in this in this episode, and then next episode I can just next episode I'll start doing like one game one game of an episode, two games an episode maybe. I don't know. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it how I can get it. Hey, we're in the second round. Let's go. I'm going to go cover two here. I have no block shedding right now. Like that, I could have gotten upwards, and uh, I probably could have gotten like 15 or 16 tackles last game if I wouldn't have been so so held up the whole time. But the whole game, I was held up. Let's go. I'm not even mad that I didn't get the sack. I had the pass pressure. If I wouldn't have, if I wouldn't have pressured them, then they wouldn't have. Third down at seven. Do I really want to? They they're telling me that that's the suggested play to blitz. No, I'm going like cover three right, cover two right now. I don't think they're gonna run it, so I'm just gonna go straight into a pass drop. If they run it, they're stupid. That was the right call. That flat cover two has that flat zone. If I would have done a cover three with a deep thirds, 
that would have screwed us over. Because deep thirds, there would have been nobody there to stop him. He would have just gone downfield for five, six yards. That blitz was absolutely useless because I did I couldn't I couldn't get past the, the line of scrimmage. That's going to be our biggest thing to try and fix is our block shedding. I've noticed that our block shedding is absolutely awful. Okay, we're on on CJ for Dorowitz. Oh, dude, I got burnt. This camera angle screws with me sometimes. Like, whenever they throw the ball, and then the camera angle tilts, and they expect you to know to change the jo like, move the joystick around with it. That was glitchy. Hit us with the cheese! It don't matter because we're still winning. I would love it if I could blitz. If I could be the one blitzing, that'd be great. I just forced the fumble, y'all. I just forced the fumble. Let's go. And then we recovered. Yeah, I hate I hate the camera angle on the careers. That's why I like playing on offense more. Hey, I got the fumble recovery too. I forced the fumble and recovered it. Let's go. That's gonna help our stats. That's a, that's a major stat pad. Don't know how many tackles I have right now. I think I have like two. And then I have a forced fumble and a fumble recovery, so that's good. Come on, y'all. Jalen Strong, I mean, I'm not going to lie. Jalen Strong's pretty good. He was in our, um, Jalen Strong was in our Arizona franchise, and he was doing pretty, he was pretty good. Uh, hey. These QBs aren't, aren't, um, sixth round talent out of Michigan State. I, I almost picked the undrafted, but that would have given us like the third or fourth string, and I wasn't trying to do that. I like playing linebacker though, because I mean, like this is what I've grown up playing. This is this I've I've always played either middle linebacker or outside linebacker. Always my whole life. That's all I've ever been. Either that or I've played fullback most of the time, too. A, l a little bit of the time in middle school, I played. A l in middle school, I was too small to play linebacker. I remember my seventh grade year, and so they played me at safety until I bulked up a little bit. I played safety and receiver, and then whenever I started gaining weight for my eighth grade year, they moved me to middle linebacker around halfway through my seventh grade year. And then I, my freshman year, they moved me to running back. But now that I'm done with my walk down nostalgia, Listen, y'all, if, if you can't blame me if, if the dude's not in my zone. I did screw us over on the one play, but I mean, I don't even think I, they didn't score on that drive. If they score on this drive, it's not going to be my fault. Even though I'm the play caller. Why would you throw it into like quadruple coverage? So what's up, Brad?
Let's go. You know what was, you know what I missed? You know what I miss? Yeah, I've got, it's gonna be Sunday, it's Sunday right now, so I mean, we, I've got, I've got school tomorrow, but. How long have you been on, how, how long have you been on holiday? Let's go. PJ Williams. I mean, I missed my goal because no, I didn't get time to have a tackle. I mean, have a, yeah, I didn't have time for tackles. I'm going to blitz here. Nuts. It's Sunday right now, but it's um, one in the morning on Sunday. That's nice. Had a month off work. Oh, I missed. I backed way. I backed off way too much. I wanted to. I wanted them to have a chance to catch it. But yeah, I mean, it's it's one in the morning on Sunday, so I mean, it's I've still got time, and we're all gonna sleep in tonight, anyways. Cause I mean, there we go. Clog up the hole. I don't even know what my stat sheet looks like right now. Whenever I whenever I get my next tackle, it'll tell me. Oh, they're passing it definitely right now. Third and nine. That's gonna be holding on the offense. Let's go. Right now, oh, it's not telling me. I'm not sure I can check right now. I'm just curious. Uh... Yeah, right now I've got four. So I mean I don't think I'm gonna have nearly the game that I had last last week. Unless I can get some sort of major You go? That should be a tackle for me. Mm. 
It was an ugly tackle, but. Eventually, I'm going to. Eventually, I'm going to start editing my videos, and so I'll be able to do the practice mode, like do practice sessions, because I don't want to do the practice sessions while I'm, while I'm streaming, because I feel like nobody's going to want to watch those. I'm probably going to do them anyways whenever we hit the season, because then it's going to really be important to get as much XP as possible. But uh, right now during the preseason, I'm gonna get enough playing time. I mean, I'm gonna start during the during the season. I was taken off downfield because I was ready for them to get snagged on, like all four of them. There were like four dudes out there, and I was ready for every single one of them to get burnt. Just absolutely mossed. But they didn't, so I'm happy. Please let this be a run. Yeah, right. I need I need to start editing videos. I just can't. I just don't have the resources currently. I'm gonna look. I'm gonna I'm gonna do a lot of research tomorrow. I mean, well, today actually. <laughs> Later on today, whenever I. After I go to sleep, I'll wake up and I'm going to do a lot of research on how to get some decent quality. Because I don't have a computer, and that's the issue. I mean, I I know that, it's, that, that it would be virtually impossible to do without a computer. But I'm going to look to see if there's anything I can do, maybe with a tablet or with a... I don't know. Maybe if there's actually a way to edit through the PlayStation, just sit here on the PlayStation and just use the remote, I don't know. I'm, I'm extremely new at this, so. Yeah, I mean, I look forward to being able to edit too. Because I, 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 I'm like you, if I'm gonna do something, I just wanna, I want it to be good. Especially if I'm doing it for other people's enjoyment. But I'll obviously still have, like, the stream series, because, I mean, I love streaming. Streaming is probably the fa my favorite part of this right now. Ooh, sit down, dude. Do you know who you're messing with? This is Ryan Palmer. The reason I'm going to be doing research tomorrow instead of asking, instead of asking my usual genie, is because you will be at work, and I'm assuming you'll be very busy. Because there was that one day where I, or where I did like my, where I was doing my first stream, and you were trying to like juggle your work. I'm assuming. Because you kept, because you told me that you were at work when you were trying to help me with my stream, because I couldn't figure out how to get my volume to work. So I'm not trying to bother you all your work. But oh, well, let's go. Oh, they're gonna go for it. What in the world? That was his first run and he got eight yards on that. I've only got three tackles, but I mean, I've got a lot of assisted tackles.
Ah, stupids. But that's what I'm uh, what I'm aiming for is to have I want to have some high quality stuff on my streams like I eventually I want to get to the point to where I've got a face cam and a and a um, green screen no I mean just have like those fun little things that make it that make a little bit of a that make a difference in the quality you know what I mean? Because, I mean, every single channel that I've watched that has a green screen, they, they put out really high quality. You, and then RBT, if you know who that is, he puts out really high quality stuff most of the time. And he's out of, he, he lives in Tennessee, too, just like me. I'm assuming he lives in Tennessee. He's always talking about Tennessee. What I mean... I dove. I'm stupid. Put some mustard on it. I didn't start playing like with headphones on until I started until I started making videos. And in the process of making videos and listening with headphones, I have realized the amount of obnoxiously stupid things the AI says in Madden. Like did you hear how many times he said screen? Screen, screen, screen. Like just just focus on the background noise. Like how obnoxious is that? And once you hear it, you can't unhear it. Let's go, fourth down and one. Hey, let's go. We turned it over. So we um, actually killed them. They upload terrible new commentary every time I turn the game on. <laughs> yeah. I mean, the commentary isn't what gets me. What gets me is the players. Um, I would just also like to point out this is officially the first win of on my channel. This game right here is the first win on my channel. So let's put that out there. Saints. Let's look at defense, because that's all we care about. Ryan Palmer tied for the most total tackles. I had three solo, four assisted tackles, totaling seven. I did not have any tackle for loss. No sacks, obviously. I would remember that. No, no interceptions. Um, no pass deflections. We forced the fumble. We recovered the fumble. Uh, 
No, I don't think we did win any with Malik. I will check, but I I think I think we got screwed over a ton of times. It's been so long since I made those Malik videos. I mean, not really so long. It's been like a almost a month. Well, it's been around a month, but I mean, I think. Yeah, I think Malik probably did win, win, win one or two. So, anyways, that's the first win of Ryan of Ryan of Ryan Palmer's career. I wanted to say Ryan Anderson. I'm stupid. <laughs> Ryan Palmer. Now we've got two. Now we've got two Golden Boys, Ryan Palmer and Malik Anderson. Okay, let's simulate. So now we're up to 1,800 XP. So, I mean, that's that's what I'm talking about. We get, we get all this going. This is going to be a hard game to win. This is going to be a hard game to get stats in. Who's the backup running back for the Steelers? D'Angelo Williams? We won't see your boy though. Le'Veon Bell ain't gonna be, ain't gonna be facing us because we ain't gonna have to play him because we aren't the starter yet. That makes me sad because I would have loved to try my luck against Le'Veon Bell. We'll, we'll probably meet him during the season though, so I mean, we'll get we'll get our butts kicked later. That makes me sad though, cause Malik, I can't even, I can't even go like to the game after this stream to check his, to check his stats or his career because the file got corrupted, and so I was, I was, I was extremely sad. Needless to say, when I realized that his file was gone, like that was, it made me, it made me upset. Because it was the only file that was corrupted. It was like usually when files get corrupted, it's like a group or a lot of the files or like all of the files get corrupted. But it was it was it was only the Malik Anderson file, and I was like, why? If you're gonna if you're gonna corrupt one file and it's just the file that it is the one file that I need to use at the moment. It's like if you if you were going to corrupt a file, why didn't you corrupt like the Arizona franchise? Because I still haven't deleted that. Because who knows? Maybe people are going to beg for me to bring it back. Probably not, but because I mean, it got nobody even watched it except for you. I feel like whenever I start to edit, whenever I edit videos, that's going to be when the subs come because. My brother made a very good point today. He told me, he said, Paxton, I love you, and I love watching your streams, but whenever I fall asleep and don't watch your streams, I'm not gonna lie, I don't even try to watch your videos because nobody's gonna, nobody wants to watch videos that are like two hours long, two and a half hours long. You need to figure out how to edit soon so you can make reasonably length videos. And it, it made sense, it's true. I need to figure out how to edit and get things edited. Because the sooner I get that done, this game's moving quick, we're already in the second quarter. I didn't even notice you left. I'm not gonna lie, I was so focused on the game. I forgot you left. I I, I, for, I didn't even notice. You probably missed everything I was just talking about.
Okay, so... I hate how you can't see behind you. I mean, it's realistic that you can't see behind you, but for me to be able to see my see the players behind me, I have to like run way back and compromise my zone, and that kills me. Yeah, D'Angelo Williams is the. Man, I'm stuck in this game. The Steelers have good backups. I know that sounds stupid to say, but essentially that's what's going on. The Steelers have just have really good backup players. Because I'm not playing starters, I'm just playing their backups. I can't... I can't follow the running back where I want to follow him because if I if I do that I'm gonna compromise my my lane and if I compromise the lane then he's just gonna break me listen how do you miss him how do you miss him what I mean I'm gonna I'm going to use Malik Anderson as the player to do the, if we, if me and Dustin go the player career route for our special series that we're talking about. But if we go the team route, which is going to take a lot longer for me to work on, I would need him, I would need his help on that if we did that, so, which is why I think we're just going to go the player route. Because it would take way too long. And I don't even know if it would work. In theory it would work, but... In... In production, not sure. I was about to say, please don't let him catch that, because technically that was in my zone, even though I, was, I had him on lockdown. But then I realized it's Bruce Gregkowski. I, I relied on them. I relied on them to help me. This is a weird score, five to three. Because because five to three means that we've kicked a field goal, they've kicked a field goal, and then they've had a sa and then we've had a safety. That's what five to three means. So that means that both of these teams are sucking right now, and nobody nobody probably knows what to do right now because. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. At least D'Angelo Williams isn't in because that would make this a whole lot harder. D'Angelo Williams is one of those players that's way harder than they should be to play in Madden. Because he's not that good, but he's really difficult to play just because it's D'Angelo Williams. It's just like Michael Vick. Even though Michael Vick is like a 60-something overall. Oh, we injured someone else. Man, we're going to have their whole backup roster injured. Having backups injured is more dangerous than having starters injured. Because then you can't afford to lose your starters. So 
So we're losing to the Steelers. Yay. It's okay. It's okay. I will admit, though, I'm much better at playing career modes than I am at playing franchise modes. Because I don't have to worry about so many things at once. All I have to worry about doing is my job. But it's a lot more fun to be in charge. Even if I lose repeatedly. There was a game that was out in like a long time ago. It was an Xbox, it was a PS3 and an Xbox 360 game. It was called NFL Coach. It had one, it, it had one game, one season. It was made by EA. It was supposed to turn into like the same thing as like Madden and two, as like Madden and EA Live and FIFA and all that. But it was just the coach, so you did everything the coach would do. That the coaches would do, you would sign players, you would work on, you would assign practice, you would work on playbook, you would work on the scheme, you would work on, you would work on um, scouting. You would do all these things that were, yeah, it was. It only had one game, and you just coached. You didn't play the games, so you were you called the plays, but you didn't get to play. It was like um, in NCAA 13 and 14, I'm, they have a coach mode, I'm pretty sure, where you can just play as the coach, but you don't control the players. I, I'm I'm almost 90% sure that, that that that's the thing in NCAA. I know it was in like the in like the older NCAA games, but I think 13 might have it. If that I think that's the one that you have that you play with NCAA 13. But yeah, I had it and I I enjoyed it, but it got. It got boring, not not necessarily boring, but it got it got um, repetitive. It got repetitive. You'd probably enjoy it. You have fourteen. I think it's in thirteen. Well, I mean, I think the coaching mode, I think it's a it's a play calling mode or something. I I'll research it and tell you because it's I I'm almost positive that it ha that that it's there that it's somewhere. Cuz I remember doing it. I remember playing as like I remember doing a franchise a long time ago. I was playing as um Texas State. I was Texas State. And I was just the coach. I didn't play as the players. I just scouted and called plays. And the team played for me. I used to be so into the NCAA games, but then we traded our PlayStation 3 in for the PS4 whenever whenever, um, whenever my PS3 stopped, stopped running right. It, like, it just stopped running well. I got slapped in. I couldn't do anything there. But yeah, stuff like that would be stuff that I would be interested in streaming or doing or making videos for on my channel because that would be, I feel like that'd be fun. Okay, I got you, man.
Let's go. I mean, Sammy Coates is gone. I just need to get some. Hey, I've got a sack. We got a sack. Oh, they're not counting as, an atta as a sack. They're counting as a tackle. They're counting it as a tackle. That makes me sad. Man, they, they, they ran straight through there. I don't know why we're losing this game so bad. I mean, hey man, you're back. So somehow we had a sack, but they counted as a ta they counted it as a tackle, and I don't know how. It was definitely a sack. <sighs> Come on. We are definitely not playing well this game. This game we have, um, like, I think we have, like, one solo tackle. And any other stats are going to be off of assists. So our stats have gotten progressively worse. Oh, let's go. Fumble. A forced fumble. Oh, he's going to take this. He's going to take this. Oh, he almost took that. Let's go. That's my second. That's my second forced fumble of the, of the preseason. So I think it's official. I've got hit sticks. I had perfect position there. I just let him turn around and I just I smacked him. Second in two games. That was just that was just perfect positioning. Like I didn't even I didn't even flick up or anything. It was just a it was just really it was just like the perfect spot. Good positioning can do a lot. I feel like they're going to run this way. Oh, they ran the opposite way. Okay. They did like they did like a counter. Well, I mean, it was a counter, not like a counter. But yeah, my PlayStation was broken. That's why it took me so long to get on my stream. I couldn't get, um, my brother was playing Grand Theft Auto, and after he got off, he went, I went to eject the disc, and the disc wouldn't eject, so I had to, we had to take the lid, we had to take the, like, the panel, the top panel off the PlayStation, unscrew it, and then there's like a, there's like a little, PlayStation has the worst design I've ever seen, ever. There's two vents on the side of the PlayStation. And inside of those vent inside of one of those vents, 
Yeah, I got you, fam. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, fam. Got you. I'm probably just going to finish this game and then go to bed. No, I'm going to finish up the last game too. So right now I'm alone, but that don't mean that no one else is going to show up. Probably means no one's going to show up, but don't know. Let's go. Man, we're making this big end zone stand. Yeah, I'm just gonna... What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna end the stream after this game, and then the next stream is gonna start with the fourth preseason game. Because there's no point in me playing a game if no one else is gonna if no one's gonna be here to watch it. So I mean, it's two in the morning right now. He was definitely out of bounds. Don't say out of bounds. Just make them kick the field goal. I mean, we've been trying our hardest to come back in this game, but, I mean, we couldn't get anything going. I mean, I'm not even, I'm not upset that we're losing this game. Because, I mean, my stats have been decent. I mean, I'm starting to pick up. The stats are starting to pick up. If All I'm missing right now is an interception. Let's go. All I'm missing is an interception and a sack, actually. For the for the preseason, but I mean, I still got this. I've got I've still got the, I've still got nine minutes of the fourth quarter. Well, would probably less than nine minutes because I'm gonna have to wait for possession to get back to me after this play. Because I mean, we're planning on stopping them third and seventeen. It's just very unlikely that they're gonna run this, so I'm gonna drop back in the pass. Okay, thank you. So all we need is a sack. To make this preseason complete, we need a sack and an interception. Because I've got uh, Tia, I've got tackles for loss, I've got forced fumbles, I've got fumble recoveries, and I've got tackles. But the only two things that I don't have, oh, and I've got pass deflect. Wait, I don't have any pass deflections, but I mean those come, those come. I guarantee you, my first interception attempt isn't going to be an isn't going to be a pick. It's going to be a pass deflection. Probably same thing for my second and third, because I'm just not gonna do so great at picking the ball off. Let's go. Take it. Take Gradkowski out of here, man. Donnell Ellerby is my man. He is. I'm so glad that I've got him on the other side of me. 
I mean, I'm, I'm, I mean, he's not going to be on the other side of me during the season. During the season, it's going to be Laurinaitis. It's going to be me and Laurinaitis. Makes me sad that I'm taking his spot a little bit because, I mean, James Laurinaitis is an Ohio State legend. And they popped me. They popped, they popped me. Not going to lie. I'm not going to get either of the stats, the, the interception or the sack. I'm not going to get it this game. Don't feel it. And they're going to keep running the ball because they're winning. Yeah, I've only got two tackles right now. But, I mean, I did force a fumble earlier. I don't know why they don't have that registered as a sack for me. If you would have thrown either of those slant routes, I would have had a pick. Either of those slants. I was waiting for him. Didn't know what I was waiting for. I've got 48 XP from Fantasy. Oh, that 175 XP is for winning, is for getting three tackles and winning the game. You have to win the game and get three tackles. If, they, if I would have gotten, if I would have gotten the ball thrown my direction, that would have been a pick. It's gonna be hard to hard to get picks going because of the camera angle. Not used to that. That's something that we don't have a lot of. The camera angle's weird. If he wouldn't have gotten held up, I would have had a tackle there. He got held up a little bit, but. Good job, man. Be a, be a good teammate. Be a good teammate, Palmer. I'm loving. I'm loving this. Ryan Palmer. That was a comeback route. That wasn't my fault. For a second, I thought it was the end route that I was supposed to be defending, but it wasn't. It was a comeback. I know that play. That was the slot drive. I feel like that's gonna be like a, this is gonna be like a four vert, so I've got to get there quick. Man, he struck me. He, he he broke my tackle. I had I had perfect position, but he broke it. A lot of the times they will run four verts out of that formation, though. They can run four verts out of pretty much anything, though. Let's go, I had a sack now. I've got a half a sack. I don't care though, I'm gonna count it. I'm gonna count it. Let's go airs. Thank you for falling over after you caught the ball. That helps us. That helps us. Dude, I got a sack for a nine-year loss. They can't. They didn't name who sacked it because it was two people. So now I've got the I've got one of the players on the on the man coverage. Oh, come on, y'all. Just when we are starting to make some, well, I mean, we haven't made any progress this whole game. As a linebacker, it's hard to affect the outcome of a game just by making the tackle. So, I mean, all you can really do is just 
play your best at, at def on defense. As a corner, as a safety, it's a lot easier to make a difference in a game because you're no matter what, you're always going to have a player you're always going to be involved in the play a corner will always have their man or their zone and it's rare that a corner is not doesn't have a player in their zone okay so this episode's about to be over just going to check our stats Luke McCown's injured now. Great. Now we got Garrett Grayson. That's why we were that's why we were sucking. Let's check our defensive stats. Um total tackles. Wow, we were way down here. Ryan Palmer. Six total tackles. Four assisted and two solo. So I mean that was awful. We had one tackle for loss. We had half of a sack. And then we had a forced fumble, a pass deflection. So, I mean, that's really good. So, I mean, all we're missing, now all we're missing, I'm going to take that half sack. I'm going to take it. So, now all we're missing is the, is the golden sack. The interception. We need an INT. That's all we need. We're up to 2,000 XP, y'all. I'm going to skip to the next week. Simulate our training. Figure out what we'll be at for experience. And then we're going to end the episode at that because nobody else is going to show up. Simulate training is going to bring us to 26-29. Listen, man. That's good. That's going to be a lot of XP to put into our player. Put into Ryan Palmer. So let's... So I'll see y'all later. Make sure that you like, comment, subscribe... Tell me your suggestions, man. Tell your friends about it. See you later. Peace.